long video. Somebody asked about settings a while back. I just didn't get a chance to make a video for them. Um, but as you can see, I'm at 20 FPS, low settings, 75% on the resolution scale, everything low, FPS shows, blah, blah, blah. And I'm gonna go through a game real quick just to show this. That's what I'm playing. Zero, uh, zero build, battle royale, solo. I got the volume off, of course, because you know how Fortnite and everything else is. I really don't have to keep explaining it, but for those who don't understand, copyrights. So, I'm going to leave it like it is. I'm just going to play it on the screen. I'm not going to touch the, uh, I'm not going to touch the controller to it. I'm just going to play from the screen, and then, you know, go from there. As you can see, in the game, no issues, right for a second. But we're gonna go ahead and jump. Seems like it's going slow right now, but let's see. I if I connect to the Wi Fi, it won't be that bad. But as you can see, we got screen tearing on this end. The video that's being recorded on the other side, no screen tearing. As you can see in the game, no issues right this second, but we're going to go ahead and jump. Seems like it's going slow right now, but let's, on the, if I connect to the Wi-Fi, it won't be that bad. But as you can see, I'm getting screen tearing on this end. The video that's being recorded on the other side, no screen tearing. No screen tearing. Alright, so I recorded the uh, video off my phone. <coughs> it's going to show screen tearing on that side. You're not going to see it on the actual screen I'm on. But as far as uh, this goes, it does have screen tearing on my end. But I'm not going to finish this match up. So, but those were the settings I have. Um, it's running slow right now. But as far as because I'm using the Wi Fi, I'm using the Ethernet, well, not the Ethernet, using the um, mobile storage data, or whatever. I, I, I can't think right now, but um, I'm using the phone, the tablets, actually, mobile uh, mobile network. But um, yeah, the game runs natively, but that's really all you can get out of this tablet. This tablet's not that strong, and as you can see in the side over there, it's already 15, 12, 13 frames. Uh, I probably can even drop some more stuff around if I don't get shot. Uh, let's see if we can try to change something on the fly right quick. Um, I can change it to 30 FPS. Nope, can't change that right now. Drop this even further. Drop the resolution. Apply. Test. Change the resolution a little bit. Seems like it's running better a little bit. Because it dropped the resolution. So yeah, it's 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 moving, but it's not the greatest, so but yeah. Now you can make changes in the settings, but honestly, like I said, you're not gonna do all that too much. Um just no point. I can move it up, change it down. But for the most part, everything is low. I mean, that's all you can do on here. You can't do anything else. Yeah, it's barely. Like now you see it's starting to pick up a little bit. But it's not too bad. But it just, like I said, you, you barely. It's better if you just play it on G4 because. This is kind of not fun or playable to me. To me, from my experience. 
I mean, even if I had to control up to it, which I have done it before. Yeah, it just is not playable as much as I want. But anyway, there you have it. Fortnite settings. Anybody that need them, there you have it. I was supposed to be doing the video on it. Just hadn't had time. But either way, it is what it is. But if you enjoyed the video, like, subscribe, share. And you know, catch you in the next video. Peace.